Um, if you could just, just. Okay, run the clip. What's up, losers, and welcome back to another Baby Forget Wednesday. Welcome back to Nellyville. <laughs> Anyways, so um. I just wanted to get on here and run my mouth because y'all know that's that's what I do best. So did y'all hear about last what was it like last weekend? Sometime last week. Brianna, we know Miss Rihanna, Miss Miss Pondy replay, Miss Make My Hair My Money. Alright, y'all y'all know who I'm talking about. Brianna and ASAP Rocky are dating. ASAP Rocky the rapper. If you're not familiar, that's not what we're here to do. Go Google him and then come back if it's that important to you, okay? They're dating. They're, they went out on the town. They get to this bar and um couldn't get in. <laughs> Rihanna. Rihanna couldn't get in the bar. So apparently what happened was she didn't have her ID. Now I read somewhere else or saw somewhere else that ASAP Rocky also didn't have his ID. But either way. Rihanna for sure did not have any identification on her and the bouncer claimed that he didn't know who she was and then of course you know anytime it's a place that serves alcohol a bar a club they have to card you right so she couldn't get in so this sparked this huge debate online of how dare they not let rihanna in rihanna's my queen she couldn't get into the bar she would have made your bar a lot of money why wouldn't why you, would you let, her, let in? her in a lot of people were like how can you not know who rihanna is rihanna's been making music forever which somebody said oh she stopped making music so now don't nobody know who she is And then other people were saying, okay, well, this man was just doing his job. It doesn't matter if she's a celebrity. If I like one of like the undercover people saw that he was letting people in without carding and whether it was Rihanna or not, this man could have lost his job. And if he would have lost his job, would Rihanna be there? Would ASAP Rocky be there to pay this man's bills? A lot of people raise a lot of good points. Somebody, Somebody else said, okay, y'all are so quick to say celebrities are just regular people and they need to be treated like everybody else and then they're being treated like everybody else and now you're mad because they wouldn't let you queen in the bar. <laughs> and then also there's the perspective of a lot of celebrities say, I'm just a regular person. I don't want special treatment. I'm just like you. But then y'all do stuff like show up to bars without ideas. So my question is, all very valid points. And I want y'all to chime in and let me know what y'all kind of think about this. Because my thing is, I don't care who you are, you're an adult. Why are you just kind of going around with that identification? Because let's just let's just take it to extreme. Because this is YouTube, let's just take it to the extreme. What if something happens, you know, uh, you, you know, not to put, I'm not trying to put anything out in the atmosphere, but if something happens to you where in an emergency and you need identification and you don't have anything on you, I mean, it could, the situation could be a lot more ugly if, if it's a police, something and you don't, oh, I don't have my ID or, oh, we can't identify this person because they didn't have identification on them. You know, it could just, y'all get what I'm saying, we're grown. I'm trying to figure out, Rihanna, did you did you change purses and run out the door and you left the wallet, in, you know, in the Cartier bag and, and you ran out with, with the Balenciaga bag? I don't know, Brands. I'm just pulling out of my behind here. It was an assistant supposed to put your license in the, I like, and ASAP, if you also didn't have your ID, I just don't understand. Did you leave the house, Rihanna, thinking, well, I'm Rihanna, I don't need an ID, I can get in anywhere because I'm mother I'm Rihanna, 50X beauty. Like, you know what I'm saying? Or was it just like an honest mistake? Now, on the argument of the bouncer didn't know who she was, okay, I know a lot of people are like, it's Rihanna. How can you not know who Rihanna is? Now, I, I, Yes, yes, she, she is, is a, a mega, mega celebrity. celebrity, but let's just pause for a second. This bouncer, I didn't see his face, but he was a Caucasian gentleman, and he looked to be a little older. 
Not to say that the older Caucasian demographic doesn't listen to Rihanna. I'm not saying that. I'm not saying that they don't know who she is. But I'm just saying that it is plausible that he didn't know who she was. Look, it's a rocky, you know, very talented young man. Uh, really, the only song that, that I can just like pick out of my brain like instantly is the song that he did with Drake and 2 Chains years ago that I love that bro. You know what I'm talking about? I'm just not the right person to ask. So I, if I saw ASAP Rocky walking down the street, I would not know who I wouldn't know who he who he was. I just I wouldn't. Honestly speaking, if I saw Rihanna just kind of like at the Galleria, just kind of walking, I could see myself walking past her and just fully walking past her and not knowing who she was. And, and I'm not saying that because she's irrelevant, I'm just saying there's different celebrities are different for everybody. Like I could fully walk down the street and I could pinpoint Miley from like a million miles away. Y'all get what I'm saying? Just because you would recognize Rihanna anywhere doesn't mean Joe Schmo Bouncer at the club is gonna recognize. Which leads me to my next point of Rihanna doesn't really seem like the type of person that's walking up to the door. Why is she walking up to the door? So I'm like, is this a stunt? Because Rihanna is still famous enough that I feel like she would be the type of person that is get, that is coming into the side door, coming through the back door, who, who has this arrangement with the owners, with the club managers, with the promoters. Like, she doesn't seem like this, like, oh, like, oh here's my ID. Like, so was this like a thing so you and ASAP could be photographed together? Like, like what was that about? Like, I'm not saying that it was stayed. I'm just saying, I, I, so like it's not a big deal. I'm sure that girl was not really that bothered. But wow, it had to be embarrassing for at least two minutes. And I saw somewhere else and somebody made a joke that it, uh, on Twitter and they had a picture of like Drake. Because you know Rihanna and Drake used to do whatever in the day. Somebody posted a picture and under the picture someone put the caption, Drake at home like... Oh, this would never happen with me. You know, just, and you know, just funny stuff. And, and, and really... It probably wouldn't have happened if she was with Drake, I'm just saying. You know, look, it, it doesn't speak to the talent or the craft or the legacy that people have. It's just that celebrity, you know, it goes up and down. You're not all, the same celebrities aren't always going to be the top. And, and that's not to say that you just peak and then fall down. I mean, look at J-Lo. J-Lo is up here sometimes and then, you know, she, you don't really see her. And then she's up here and then, you know, she kind of go away. You know, it just, and then this might be just one of those time periods for Rihanna, maybe. I don't know. And what a humbling experience for ASAP Brocky. Like, I know he had to be like, damn, I can't even get my girl in this bar, dog. Because he, he probably knew he was going to get rolled out, you know. Also, so it could have been a thing where, the, and this is this is a stretch, this is a reach. Don't come for me. Don't come for me. But I just want to make sure I'm hitting everything. You know what I'm saying? It could have been something where they just didn't like the way that they were dressed. Sometimes. Bars and clubs and stuff just won't let people in because they don't like their attire. Let's just assume that this bouncer didn't know who Rihanna and ASAP Rocky were. Most of the time, you cannot get in without an ID, just period. But sometimes, you know, people like, man, come on, come on, come on, come in. Maybe he gave them a hard time because he, they just didn't have the look. Because how can I say this and, and say it nicely? I personally was not feeling the attire. You know what I'm saying? They looked, I'm trying to choose my words so carefully. Um, I've seen both of them dress better. That's the nicest way I can put it. I've seen both of them dress better and I've seen a lot of people saying how sickening Rihanna, oh, they were like, oh, Rihanna slay. And I'm thinking like, first of all, why you got this big ass, thick ass, fuzzy ass hat on in the middle of summer? You look, fashion faux pas have changed and people are wearing whatever they want. But I'm like, why you got... And then the, the dress just looked like Ross off the rack. I know it wasn't Ross off the rack. I'm sure it was very expensive. But it didn't look... I'm just saying the point is is that some clubs and bars are really strict about their, how they want people to look a certain way. And maybe they got discriminated. Maybe if they, 
You, what? What? It's my, this my op that's my opinion. If you don't like it, <sighs> anyways, that's all I have to say about it. Let me know what y'all think in the comment section down below. Come find me on Twitter and we can debate about it. If I hurt your feelings, if she's your favorite, she's your queen. No offense. I love. I love Rihanna. I do. I do. Me and Rihanna go back. We go way back. We do. I just wanted to make sure I was hitting it from every side and putting putting out the facts. Hello. Anyways, go ahead and click the big red subscribe button. Give this video a bit fat thick thumbs on and broke something. Oh, what's that? Okay, go ahead and give this video a bit fat thick thumbs up. And uh, click the post notification bell so you get notified every time I upload a brand new video. Whoa, whoa. And I will see you in the next video. Bye. I love you so much. Bye. You know, look, I, I, look, I, I do, no, I ain't gonna say that. Oh.